Saturday morning as a child when I lived in Margaret Street in Ammonford. It was a very busy morning. We had our chores to do. Also, I had to help my mother. Uh, Saturday was a very busy day. My mother would, uh, all the afternoon, was spent cooking because uh, you had to prepare for Sunday. You didn't cook a lot on a Sunday. So all meats and puddings were done on Saturday afternoon. And I think this is the reason my mother was glad to get rid of me. And my great feeling was to have my dad to take me to visit his family in Pantafin. Now, from the bottom of Fenton Terrace downwards, nearly every other house had a relative in it. My grandfather had come to work in the tin works at the start of the 1880s, along with his new bride, my grandmother. She had a number of sisters, and as you realise at that time, you didn't go on hotel holidays, you visited family. And these sisters came to stay with them, and actually married Pantafin and men, which is why we had so many aunts, cousins, uncles in Pantafin. And this is why every other house had somebody that was related. Now, my big treat was to call on them on either a Friday or a Saturday, where the big cooking days were on. And I used to be treated like a queen, with the best from each home. Auntie Jane's family kept pigeons, and what a treat it was to watch them being cleaned, pruned, whereas Auntie Sarah was a small and full of life character, and she would dress me up, put ribbons in my hair, I used to really feel good. This was the big thing about Pantafinan. Each home and house had something special and the community spirit was so much part of, its, of this grand day.